Aviation remains the fastest means of linking people and businesses. And the Mori Salam Mohammed International Airport, Lagos, remains Nigeria's major gateway. In 2015, over 7 million passengers travel through and it's a George Africa's fifth busiest airport. In this check-in area, counter staff attend to as many as 8,000 passengers per day. A few years ago, the terminal was expanded on the D and E wings to give room for better passenger facilitation. While the airport authority says it's also working on other areas, a looming increase in passenger numbers may stretch the facilities as more international flights may fly into Lagos when the Abuja airport closure begins. The Minister of State for Budget on a recent visit to the terminal believes there is need to upgrade the departure area of the airport and the luggage handling process. What is clear is that a lot of resources are required to bring the Mosala Mohammed International uh, uh, Airport to um, a better standard. As it is now, the departure area of the airport is is like a market area. It's not a good impression for visitors that come into Nigeria uh, to have to experience up to two hours before they are processed and on to their flights. In the face of an upsurge in passenger traffic, the issue that may arise at the General Aviation Terminal, where 7,000 passengers are already processed each day, is the need to provide more screening machines at the terminal boarding exit point. Every morning, in our terminal out there, you have about 1,000 passengers filing in to go through only one scanner. That shouldn't be. As Lagos gets up to receive more traffic when the runway is closed in Abuja, the airport authority of Nigeria says both runways in Lagos are functional and ready to accommodate the expected increase in flights. Bukola Joe Ukitumbi, Channels Television News.